Longtime rivals Charlotte Smith and Westmore go back to their CAA days 20 years prior, and they reunite tonight. Here's an early turnover for the Phoenix, and the point guard, Isis Adams, the transfer of ECU, goes right to the rack and misses her first attempt. Starting five, Saniah Rivers, the name of the game off the Player of the Week honors. Good ball movement early as Hayes attacks the basket, and that's a blocking foul. A chance for the N1 for Madison Hayes on this drive. Madison did a great job attacking the high foot there on the defender on the closeout. 15 turnovers a game last year. That was the strength of the Phoenix, who finished 17 and 12, a winning record. Walton lets it fly, and a good start for three. Rivers on attack mode. Nice find to Collins. That's great vision from Sinai. Absolutely. Absolutely. The, the help defender came up. From day one. Here's another point guard, Walton, with a nice step through. Adams with the Hezzy. And a bit short. NC State's offense now in the top 20 in the country in scoring. They haven't missed a shot from the field tonight. Baldwin with the size mismatch. And Derrigier with the block. Maya Johnson there. Taylor in transition, excellent find, and that's where Elon's going to make their money. She's out of Winston-Salem, local kid. Paz did a really good job last game with 16 points. And how about that pass to LaRue on the drive? NC State was cruising 7-0 into the media timeout, but Elon's made the adjustment. Here's Madison Hayes knocking down the three, and her hot streak continues. Three of six from downtown this year. Willard into some traffic, and that ball saved in play. This is where Rivers is special. What vision to Great Collins. Pass. And oh my goodness, the passing is and one, two. Floating it up, but having a little bit of air up under it. Oh, that split two yep. receivers on the go route. Here's the true freshman, Marasia Pass, who scored 16 on Sunday at Gardner-Webb. Sets up Willard, not afraid to shoot from distance. Rivers now. So electric in the lane. Nice kick out to Collins, who knocks it in. Mamie Collins is having a year. Ball movement here for NC State. Yeah, absolutely. The, the, the ball movement in the one more pass, that's who you talk about. This was a player who made nine all of last season. What a jump here in year five. Hey, that's what it's all about in the summer. That summer work, working on things that you feel like you can get better at, and it's definitely showing this year for her. Westmore joke, not only collecting NLI money, but collecting Social Security for a 24-year-old. <laughs> As Willard couldn't pull off the bunny. Now this is Jessica Booth. Couldn't pull off the John Wilkes and bounced it out. James with a nice find to Collins. Wow, it's like playing volleyball down there. Pretty good find to the tall player. Early 2000s. Here with Kai Crutchfield, a three-time champion in ACC. Collins on great a great pass. find. Isaiah James with a nice lefty pass. Um, something that's going to be huge when it comes to ACC play. Those are two top 100 recruits in the country. As Elon, the air ball from Diamond Monroe on the three. Nice find to Brooks. Oh, the reversal, and she missed it. Creative there from the freshman. Elon looks to run and a steal. Here's Hayes, all by her lonesome for the gifted layup. Final possession for Elon. Pass, needs a bucket. Johnson lets it fly. And there you go. Good end of the quarter for the Phoenix. He's playing some good defense. Um, you know, as Coach Moore, you know, that's what you want to see as a freshman, and then you still have three more years with him. Here's Cox, wide open, and couldn't hit the three. On the attack, Johnson. Every shot contested here for Elon. And a loose ball goes out to Brooks. Look at that behind the back. Nice pass, leading to a three. How great is Zoe Brooks to really pull in the defenders into the paint? Zoe Brooks definitely pulled in the defender and then had the defender have ball movement. That'll test now, Elon defensively. Trying to post up Johnson here. Way off. Look at Brooks holding step for step with Walton and the block. That's great defense. Points in the last eight minutes. That has not been the problem for NC State. Here's a wide open James. And Taylor collects the board. 
Open three. Does not go in transition. Willard lost the rebound. And this game feels like a bunch of freshmen in there. Some AAU pace to it. Steele is left alone. And a good first basket of the night for the true freshman of Edmond, Oklahoma. Willard's left alone. And Elon just can't buy a bucket right now. I really think Elon just needs to slow down. Uh, NC State's really speeding up the pace, and it's, it's working better for, for NC State. Move at 100 miles an hour. Fourth three for the Wolfpack. Hayes in attack mode. Now in distribute mode. Rattles out the three. Hayes, though, fighting for the board and a nice putback. All that being said, only the first second chance bucket for NC State tonight. With all they've that been offense. making all of them. How about this block and the effort there from Isaiah? Almost crashed into the photog. It's a great timing. You know, UConn is, in a, is in an easy team to beat. So staying that consistent and being able to facilitate for her teammates is, is really what helped them win that game. Nice bucket there from Marasia Pass. Being UConn in Reynolds Coliseum is definitely what was warm into the hearts for the, for the Wolfpack fans. The true freshman off on the three. Hayes has been everywhere on the glass. Good strip, though, by Elon. By the way, Orem, Utah, is an amazing place. If you get a chance, you got to visit. Here's a steal for Sanaya Rivers, and she is running the break in transition. First points tonight for Sanaya. Seems like Elon came out here in his own start second half. James breaks right through it, and Hayes hits the first three of the second half. Five triples tonight for NC State. You're only five threes a game. So far, they're about eight a night as this open three bangs out. Rivers running and gunning. Oh, look at that step back. And it just rattled out. In the, in the top 25 here at the start of the season. That had been a six-week drought, as a matter of fact, for NC State. Not being in the national polls. Good bucket in her traffic for Maya Johnson. Here they are right back with seven other ranked teams in the ACC and we're two weeks into the season. For sure, for sure. And I mean, this is them, you know, a statement. Kingston, Rhode Island. Oh, look at Taylor jump up. She said, don't sleep on the order of the Phoenix. And then running the lane. Nice move to finish it for Asia James. Against NC State, you know, finding that open, that open player and not necessarily cutting just a cut, but cutting to the open space. Good pass by River Baldwin finding Mimi Collins. I mean, she's shooting the ball really well, too. So when you say, you know, stretch the court, you know, she's running in transition and she's shooting the open three. So as a five player, you know, when it gets to ACC playing. Nations are up in the Moore household, but he is not in the Christmas season just yet. I feel like in that situation, you have to wait for Thanksgiving. Has to trust his wife to make those important. Nice back to her look to James. Wow, Baldwin found her. Here from NC State. Oh. And has won 20 plus games in the stretch of eight years. Zoe Brooks will look to add to those totals with an M1 opportunity. Extremely proud to be a part of that, and it's, it's about the legacy. You know, now you got NC State having new locker rooms with sleeping pods and all that stuff. That's the one thing. You know, I'm just like, dang, I, I wouldn't even go home after you build you build it to to sustain the program and you know to continue to win those ACC championships. Pass is a fun little player to watch. Great find and transition there for Isis Adams. Some more transition defense. Marasia's tiny, listed five four, but she plays well beyond that size. Williamson all by herself, fought through the trees and gets the layup. The Southern Utah. Williamson was the WAC Defensive Player of the Year and in second team all WAC. Adams then blocked by the all defensive player. Feeding Brooks behind the back. Oh, she missed it. Did everything right. Steals turn. That time she hits it. Especially next week when those big tournaments take place. NC State will play number five Colorado the day after Thanksgiving as Zoe Brooks drops in the, the layup. And she knocked out a, a three. Brought this place to its feet as well. Steele chucks up a three, and that'll help her second career triple. NC State will secure its seventh straight win over Elon as Pass puts up a good effort late. And Elon closes out the books up to 35 points. And the Wolfpack moved to 3-0.
notching an impressive win here over Elon.